kind of lead in the fourth quarter and let it slip away like that? How tough is this one to take? Uh, I mean, every loss is pretty tough, but um, to go out in a close one is pretty hard. Um, knowing that we could have executed a little bit better. Um, not not saying that while well, Washington State isn't good. They're a great team. They executed more plays than we did. Um, we just fell a little short at the end. The uh, you know offensively, obviously, second week in a row, you guys have had turnover at the quarterback position tonight. It was because of injury. Uh, you know what, what has that done to you guys offensively with your rhythm and things to 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 be through two quarterbacks in both of your games here. Uh, yeah, I mean, I think it's just a part of football. Um, that's why both of them practice hard during the week to be able to step in and um, take over the starting position. But um, Brett, will, Brett will Hill, he'll be back strong, and um, Montel will get the job done just like he did last week. Look like you and Montel hooked up several times. Look, look like decent chemistry. How, how much have you guys had a chance to work together? Um, we worked right off the bat as soon as he got here, just like I did when I first got here with Brett. And I think just repetition comes with um, – um, I mean, chemistry comes with repetition. So I think the more we practice on it, the um, better we get throughout the year. Uh, you know, I think it was beginning of the third overtime that try, tried to get you on, down the sideline. Looked like it, it was close. Uh, t- what did you see there, and how close was that to being one you could grab? Uh, I mean, it was just out of my reach. I um, wish you could have it back. Um, most players do. But um, just after I prepare it, um, come get it next week. How tough was that to see Brett go out like that? And, and uh, what did you think of Montel tonight? Um, I actually didn't know Brett was out until halftime when he was taking off his stuff, but um, I just talked to him. I know I know he wanted this game bad, pretty much. This is where he's from, but um, yeah, it's just a part of the game. Injury comes with it, so I hope he can um, bounce back. What would you think of how Montel came in with a lot on his shoulders and ran things? Uh, I think he did pretty good. Um, Montel usually handles um, everything good, and um, Coach just tells the whole team how we're going to handle adversity. Um, Brett going down was just a small um, lump of adversity, and I think we got through it pretty well. We just fell a little short. That uh, turnover in the fourth quarter obviously turns into a touchdown. You know, in the end, how, how big of a swing was that play? Uh, I mean, it was definitely a big swing, obviously, because when you score on defense, that's a vital part. Um, but that's between um, Coach Hill and the um, quarterbacks. They'll get it done, and they'll work on it to uh, eliminate, eliminate plays like that. Your defense has allowed, I think, 23, not counting overtime, 23 points in two games. What, what are you seeing out of that group, and, and uh, how much are they kind of leading the charge for this team right now? Um, yeah, like I said at the beginning of the season, I like the, um, the way the young guys run around. They're very young and they're very energetic, and I just hope they keep that energy. And they're going to be a pretty good defense throughout, throughout the season. So, you know, the swings in this game, triple overtime, how emotional was this contest you guys played in tonight? I mean, you got you try to control your emotions as much as you do, but um, sometimes it's a little um, hard to control them when you're on the upside of it. And then um, when you're on the downside of it, you just try not to um, panic. But coach, is always, coach always tells us to stay on the even plane so you can handle it the right way. Um, and that's just what happened. You know, I know that it's unfortunate whenever Brett would go down, but the start you guys got off to, it felt like you were kind of in a nice rhythm there, you know, that first quarter with him at the trigger. I don't know, would you agree? I mean, is it unfortunate um, you went down at that point in time? Uh, yeah, um, I think we had a pretty good game plan coming into it. So whether Montel or Brett was in, I think we would have operated well. Um, we just slowed down a little bit in the third quarter, I think. but. Um, we're definitely going to practice to play the whole game. With the way it kind of snowballed there at the end in the fourth quarter, I mean, was that with the punt, you know, fumbled and then the interception, I mean, does that make it tougher when if you just hold on to the ball there, you probably win? Uh, yeah, I think it definitely makes it tougher, but um, a ball's not perfectly round, so I don't think it's going to bounce the way you think it is every time. So, um, I mean, you just got to um, go with what happens. Kind of gets lost in, in this because you guys lost, but uh, your kicker who – you know, has very little experience, uh, comes out tonight and nails a couple of pressure kicks in, in overtime. What did you guys learn about him tonight? Uh, I mean, Hayden's pretty, he's a pretty cool kid off the field. So, I mean, he practices his butt off in practice and he, he hits them in practice. So, coach always says what happens in practice is going to be happening in the game. And he went out there without even second guessing himself, um, kept his eye on the ball like Coach Reed teaches and he knocked him through. I would say quick turnaround to Thursday. How do you guys kind of put this behind you and try to start conference play, you know, Thursday night? Uh, I think it's big on just the healing of the body. Our trainers and our um, um, training staff will definitely get our bodies back right, and then we get a quick lift when we get back. We'll get our bodies back. Um, I think we'll be ready for um, New Mexico Thursday. I don't know if it happens with every game, but was, was it a little back and forth with you guys in, in WCDBs at all or anything like that? or just? Uh, I mean, it comes with football. DBs usually talk a lot, and it's um, our job to go out there and compete. But, I mean, it's football. You're going to go against different ones every week. And uh, it was just a good game today. We battled out, and I give them props for doing what they did. And hopefully they give me props for doing what I did. Thanks, guys.